All right, so the goal for today is to make your webcam look awesome. Because the webcams that come on computers, they're, they're just, uh, ah, I wanna throw up whenever I look at it. You really wanna show up for your important meetings and job interviews, poorly lit, poor camera, uh-uh. Dude, online dating, you wanna make a good first impression and you don't wanna do that with like a really bad quality webcam. Yeah, no way. You want that second date? You need, you need better quality than this, man. So today we're gonna be building out the ultimate webcam setup. So let's start with the camera. And this portion of this video is sponsored by by Canon. Now Canon has hooked us up with the Canon EOS RP webcam starter and power supply kit. Now first of all, we get a Canon EOS RP with a 24 to 105. It's an F4 to 7.1. And now this camera alone has got to be one of the best values out there because you're getting a full frame sensor. You get the great Canon colors. You get that flip screen. You, you actually bought one, right? Yeah, we're actually shooting the Sam cam with it. Yeah. Hello. Let's see what else we got. Man, I kind of feel like I'm on an infomercial right now. Does it look like an infomercial right now with this yeah. nice setup? It also feels like after this, you're gonna teach us how to decorate the living room. Interior decorating with potato jet. But this kit also comes with a few other things. This looks like the AC adapter so that we can get constant power to the camera. Now this camera alone is already enough to go out and start shooting video and photos. But of course, when it comes to having meetings, you always have that one idiot that doesn't shut up and just keep talking forever. And then he makes your meetings all a lot longer than they needs to be. Why'd you look straight at me when you said that? You're very talkative, Sam. Is this an intervention? So with this power supply, you don't have to worry about having to swap out your battery halfway through the meeting. Cable just comes out the side, close it up. So now we have pretty much infinite power. Also comes with this USB-C cable so you could connect the camera to the computer. And then I just have to go in and install EOS Webcam Utility, which is free off their website. So we're pretty much set up to go. Only other things you might wanna get is maybe like a little tripod, like the one I have right here, and also an SD card. Although you don't really need the SD card to live stream or to set it up as the webcam. That's more if you wanna take this camera out and shoot with it, which of course you're gonna wanna shoot with it if you have such an awesome camera like this, right? How many people do you think are going to go to their bosses and go, hey, uh, for work, I need my meetings to look more professional. <laughs> Goodbye. But really, they just want it so that they can go out yeah. and get some awesome shots with it. Hey, Gene, so for work. No, for live streaming. Yeah, this is going to be awesome. Oh, yeah. Immediately. Look how much better that looks. Sam, come here. Check this out. All right. This Dang. says professional. Oh, man. Like this doesn't look like a webcam. I also placed this camera right over the screen just so that my eye line isn't too off. Is it yeah, weird to looks... put webcams at different angles? That's right, because then if you're talking to someone, they're like, why are you looking over there? I know, no, right? I'm looking at you, what do you mean? <laughs> Dual pixel autofocus still works with the webcam. Yeah, check it out, I'm gonna tap on my Ooh. face. Oh, this looks so dramatic. I wanna try calling somebody. Hello there. <laughs> Why you look so dramatic right now? Do you think this angle is a little bit too dramatic? It is dramatic. I figured it, it suits you. You know how you use your webcam to teach all your students now? I figured I'll set this up for you and I was thinking like you could do an angle like this. Welcome class. So today you are gonna run a hundred miles. And just continually to give them the side eye. <laughs> I just wanted to call you for my super professional setup. Jonathan will know right away. He'll be like, yeah, this yeah. is not a webcam. Hey, what's up, man? How you doing? Good, good. So I just wanted to come and show you my video quality from my webcam. It looks really good. Wait, are you actually zooming in from the camera itself? Yeah, pretty fancy, huh? What? Yeah, oh, it's huh? Really good. It's pretty clear. Look at that. I can see your pores. <laughs> <laughs> okay, maybe I need to lower this resolution a little bit then. Can you guess what my webcam is right now? I'm assuming it's the USR. Canon oh, uh, RP. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's close. What are your thoughts on the Canon EOS RP? So I wanted to get that one. So right now there's a sale on this RP with this whole kit. Here, I'll give you the sales pitch right here. You can get this whole kit, which includes the camera, the lens, and actually it's attached to power right now so that you can leave this on all day. And wait, <laughs> there's more. I love that I can zoom a webcam. That's kind of crazy. I've never experienced being you know, able to just... <laughs> Also use the code down there in the description to get a free backpack along with your kit. What? That's not bad. That's not bad. <laughs> Open the bag. We need to see the inside. Yeah, storage for all your lenses, your pockets, your camera. Yeah. Absolutely free. If you call right now, actually don't call, like click on the link in the description. That's the, that's the new way to say it, right? How do we improve on this webcam more? Maybe get a better looking person to sit in front of it. <laughs> 
I'm gonna hang up now, bye. All right, so let's go ahead and see how this looks in my studio. This is actually where I take almost all my online calls and meetings and the picture quality has always bugged me. I mean, like, look at that, it looks all terrible. Look at that highlight roll off, all that, nasty. All right, so I've gone ahead and plugged in the EOS RP. And let me go ahead and switch it over. And oh my God, yeah, that looks a thousand times better. And of course we have Canon's dual pixel autofocus, which is fantastic. We have that 26.2 megapixel sensor. Sam, you have a 35 mil prime, right? For this yeah, camera? Yeah, I do. Yeah, let's check it out. Oh yeah, look at that. 35 mil F1.8, look how blurry that background is. Oh my God, this looks too professional for a webcam. <laughs> well, there's a decent amount of lighting here in the studio, but one of the things that's nice about a full frame sensor is that they tend to be pretty good in low light. Sam, could you shut off that light real quick? Oh yeah, I'm gonna put it into manual mode and bring up the exposure. I think I'm at ISO 5000 right now and still looks pretty clean, right? That's what I mean, full frame sensors look nice. You wanna see how bad the webcam looks? Oh my gosh, oh, this is so disgusting. Before, and after, oh my God, this is so much better. So Carrie's a middle school teacher and you've been doing all your teaching through webcam, right? Yeah. You know how there's those filters you can apply where it makes it look like you're in a cool location? I kinda wanna yeah. do one of those, but in real life. <laughs> oh. <laughs> all right, so I think we got a pretty decent shot here. So all I have to do, connect this to the computer and we also get pretty decent cell reception here. So we can tether online like that. Now, depending on what you're doing, whether you're live streaming or you're a gamer or you're a middle school teacher, your, your needs are gonna be a little bit different. Now, if you're looking to get multiple camera angles, one of the things to look into is an HDMI switcher. And there's ones that are relatively inexpensive where you can send in four HDMI signals and switch them back and forth. Forth, so you can use this setup or any camera that really puts out HDMI. Another thing is audio. And earlier we were actually just using the audio out of the laptop, which actually didn't sound too bad, right? But depending on what you're doing, your environment, you might want to plug in different audio sources. Now there's a lot of microphones out there that are pretty good and just hook up to your computer via USB. So you plug that in, you just select your audio source. I happen to have a lot of professional microphones laying around that are all XLR. So what I would be looking up is an XLR audio interface for your computer. So I'm gonna get a few more things set up here and let's see if we can get a little stream going. All right, so we have our camera hooked up to the computer, computer's hooked up to internet. We also have the audio interface attached to the computer. Then this microphone hooked up to the audio interface. Let's see if this works. Oh yeah, look at that. I look like a reporter. I know, right? <laughs> You could even slightly dip the microphone out of frame. All right, now I just gotta fill in a little bit of light on carry here. And there we go, yeah. This is a bicolor light, so I can adjust the color temperature, make it nice and warm so it fits in. Looking pretty good. I mean, is this not the ultimate webcam setup? Imagine being able to live stream to your students like this. <laughs> They might be more engaged and pay attention more. They'd be like, where are you at, Miss Kennedy? What's going on? Why, how why is it such good quality? I know, right? <laughs> like I never do live streams, but if I ever did, it would have to be something like this. Welcome. <laughs> <laughs> you could actually rig your computer right underneath the camera. So you could actually see back like the comments and all that if you're live streaming. But yeah, look at this. It looks like a fake background. What did you say? It looks like one of those fake backgrounds. Yeah, mission accomplished. That's an amazing <laughs> Zoom background for a class. Oh my goodness. Does it look like I'm a reporter right now? Like, reporting <laughs> Yeah, all you need is a mic. You know, like, this is Carrie Kennedy reporting from. <laughs> here, bring it up. Here. There we go. There you there we go. go. Now you got your microphone, too. <laughs> Every time you call us, expect this kind of quality. Or like, I want her students to ask, like, is that a fake background? She goes, yeah, and they go, okay, that's that's my goal. <laughs> I wanted to think it's fake. Have fun, Have fun. Honestly, the setup wasn't as hard as I was expecting it to be. Like, honestly, I thought we would run into more issues and have it be more complicated. This whole process was actually pretty easy. Anyways, thanks again to Canon for sponsoring this episode. And uh, yeah, I, I still don't know how to end these videos. You know, I think I have like over 200 videos on YouTube now and every single one, I'm like, how do I end this video? Yeah, I don't know.